Oh, if anybody who didn't catch my original stream, my original, my Leon playthrough, uh, I, uh, wait, can she just, does she just not need to go to the generator room? Looks blocked off. Anyway, I did that sequence. Yeah, uh, Orin, you're ahead of, you're ahead of that part I'm talking about. Okay. You know when you're in the, what the fuck was that? When I mean, you know you're in the, uh, you're escaping the jail, and you're about to leave, and you have Ada and whatnot. Long story short, that sequence where you're running from the zombies. Um. The hell's the liquor? Fuck it. I chucked the flashbang and it ran through him. I didn't go left and unlock the other the other way. I was I did it the dumb way. I mean I did it, but I did it the dumb way. It was hilarious. After I saw a different streamer do it, you're not crispy. I don't trust you. But anyway, I did it the dumb way. It was hilarious when I watched another streamer do it. And I was like, oh, I'm stupid. Which part? The part. Nice. <laughs> Not nice. I just remember I don't have enough. I don't have that much ammo. Uh, the part when you're escaping the jail, like you know, all right, when you do the when you do the electronic thing puzzle part where you get the connections going and stuff, and then you go in and get the key card to get out of the bit the garage. That sequence right there when you're when all the jail cells open and shit, and all the zombies coming at you and whatnot. I. Hold on. Let me see if I can let me see if I can juke these guys and not waste a shot. But yeah, anyway. Walking plague did the same thing. I I didn't think at all to go to the left, hit the switch, and go around them. I ran at them like like when I when I went I went at them first, right? And I'm like, I do not have enough ammo for this. I'm all at, right? And I'm just like, what the fuck? And then I died from like, I think I got hit. And then I think I got bit by a zombie. And then Mr. X grabbed me. I think some shit. Anyway, I'm like, oh, I have, this is what that flashbang is for. Quote, unquote. So I ran at a second attempt. Flashbang ran and Mr. X popped up. I'm like, oh shit. Well, what the fuck? And then like, you know, you get around him and whatnot. And then that's it. But like, I did it the dumb way, basically. You're supposed to go left and go around the zombies. <laughs> Alright, looks like I might have to waste a round. Or not. Oh, you little bastard. Take the damage. Fuck it. I want to see what's in these anyway. I think she's dead dead. She's just jerking around like a fucking... Okay. dumb <laughs> whatever just take the damage take the damage that's how bad it was that flashbang that was last in there all right let's roll we're done let's get back out to the to the garage if i absolutely need to i just reload the save and try to and shoot them and run around them and do it smart and safe My guess is you don't even go to the generator room in this playthrough. Okay, cool. I, I, I guess the liquor despawned. 
Yeah, that way it's just blocked off. And this is, oh, do I unlock this? Yeah, the liquor's around the corner. Fuck that way. I may end up needing to come that way later, but we'll see. I hear the liquor around the corner. I wanted to unlock that door. Just so I can at least have it unlocked in case I need it. But in case I need it, I'll... I'll whatever. All right, let's roll. Uh, this way. Oh, wait. I need to go back and get that red dank weed. Which way is it? Fine range. I gotta go back. Whoops, I'm done. Said so it must have been nuts. Oh, hell yeah. It was. I mean, it's like at least six or seven zombies come after. Not to mention the one guy in the hallway when you first come in, he gets up too. Hold that thought. These guys do not know I exist. They do not know I exist. I only want this. That's all I wanted. I'm out of here. But it's weird though because, okay. The thing is, stream, when you're walking, right? You're making a little bit of noise. <clears throat> when you're doing this, you're making literally no noise. But for some reason, the lickers can still hear that. At least compared to the Leon playthrough. Make a noise, make a noise. Where are you? That way. Got you. Oh, wait, this door is just straight up locked. Okay. I guess I have to unlock that door from some other means, or does that door just stay locked? The liquor's way down there. Back them. All right, here. All right. Took a little damage, but we're okay. We'll be all right. We'll, we'll be fine. Don't worry about it. Rub some, I rub some neosporin on it later. We'll be good. you up so they need you I still need you for the mansion too there's some stuff hold on I can go back right now if I absolutely wanted to right and back that way uh question stream I don't care about spoilers is it worth it to go back right here right now right here and right now I'll wait for that is it worth it to go back Because Mr. Asshole is despawned, so I'm not worried. I don't have to worry about him. How long have you been streaming on Twitch? Um, I've been streaming this year. March will be three years. Because my first stream was on my birthday, uh, March 18th, which is so I turn. That's the sig. That's the genuine signature for my stream. Is my f my anniversary. For streaming is also my birthday. Uh, so, yep, three years. Yep, it's worth it. All right, I'm doing it. Because it's not even like I have to worry about enemies and stuff. Like, everything's taken care of for the most part, and it's just zombie here and there. But Mr. Asshole is despawned, so I don't worry about him and stuff. Okay, spare key. Spare key. Oh, okay. I found out what that's for. Let's do it. Oh, wait. I can't go back. Because I fell down here. My only way to go back. Let me see. Let me think. Yeah, I can't go back this way at least because he broke down the way back. 
Um, I gotta go for it. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> yes, don't actually know. <laughs> uh, the button for the terminal. Button for the terminal. Button for the terminal. Let's see if I got the thing in there. I think it's follow time. I got a picture. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I took a picture that day. Hold on, I'm gonna do that right now. I took a picture, but I got you. Hold up, I got you. I got you. I got you. Right here. Oh, this this is that. That's something different. Hold on. I got you. I got you. I got you. Here we go. Follow time. Follow time. Not follow age. Follow time. Any tips from a newbie for streaming? Don't give up. First off. Don't give up. Cause my boy Walker Flake and Chad Tay, I took I went on, I went on a little bit of hiatus, slash gave up for a little while, but it was literally because of him that I that I'm streaming now. They basically talked me into it. He's like, dude, you need to get back into it. Basically, is what he said. And been at it nonstop. I mean, I may I may miss a week here or there, but like, I'm not going nowhere. I'm doing I'm, I'm in this for life until Twitch for, for so long as Twitch exists, I will be here. So don't give up. No matter how hard it gets, no matter how many trolls come by, uh, no, no matter what, don't give up, first off. Second off, don't get into it thinking, oh, I just get this much money playing a game. Don't think, don't have that mind state or you won't succeed as, as a streamer, my opinion. Uh, if you're like me, starting from literally zero... It's hard, dude. Not gonna lie, it's hard. Cause I literally, I've like for the first, say, year before my hiatus of me streaming, I would have literally just so many streams and just nobody watching. No matter what game I play, just nobody watching. Uh, so like I said, it gets hard, dude. But like I said, just keep at it. My next, my next bit of advice: have something, have something about you that's attracted the viewers, right? And by that, I mean either be funny, uh, do you know, like if you have a t certain type of game also helps too. Uh, you play sports games, you play fighting games, you play shooters, whatever. Have a main game or main type of game if you, and your, your regulars will come back. Fuck. Um, oh my God. Fuck. Is that spaghetti? What was he eating? What is, what is that? What is that? What was that? What was that? Anyway. I don't want to hit that. I might spawn. Hold on. Go through the cheese elevator and you trigger Mr. X? Okay, cool. It's a good thing. It's a good thing. Woo! Holy shit. I, uh... I'm going to still keep that saved, though. I'm going to and put this in the box. Yeah. I might need that. I might need that. But anyway... Have something about have something have something about that's attractive to your viewers. Uh, you do you no know hit run gameplay. You do speed runs. You either be funny or you know what I'm saying like it has to be something about you that's unique to you that attracts people to want to stay and hang out and whatnot. Or just be nice as hell, whatever works, right? But it has to be you though. Like you never want to put on the act, and a lot of people will see through that. Ooh, I have enough to make a full thing, by the way. <clears throat> uh, shit. Um, I'm stupid. I had the grenade launcher on me. <laughs> uh, hold that thought. Put one of these back. Okay, give me that back. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's that's the primary pieces of becoming a, a decent streamer slash successful streamer. Has something about you that's unique. Don't give up. And me. Oh, one of the tip my favorite streamer gave me when I first started: make sure you always, always, always play games you actually enjoy. Never play a game just to get viewers. Uh, because if you're not having fun, a lot of people will leave because they just see you just being a salty, bitter asshole, basically. Like, just always make sure you play games you actually like. Put that on that, because I'm dumb. What does that do? Increase accuracy of some horse shit? 
Uh, I'm not sure to find both flaming acid rounds here for so low. I didn't even read what that was. What that did. Whatever. Uh. Yeah, I've been in the bed about about a month. Okay, seen some growth. Yep. It takes a while. Even me, I'm barely at 700, and like I said, I've been streaming for three years. A lot of it was just getting lucky on some streams. See, my follow time is ass. Damn, really? Holy shit. A year and eight months? Holy shit. Yeah, Supernatural's been with me since uh, my Resident Evil stream. Oh, you said Mr. Max pops up, right? So let me go ahead and put that in the fingers. Boring. I just followed out. Uh, yeah, he's been the super nice. Been we. He's one of my year ones, is what I call him. He's one of my year ones. Hey, thank we. I wish I can eat that off the ground like Resident Evil Four. Like, I legit wish I could eat that off the ground. Can I come back? I hope I can come back. Can I come back? I hope I can come back. But it's usually depending on the game I'm playing. Yep, mm-hmm. Uh, playing RET doesn't give a ton of growth, but I really like it. So I play exactly. That's all. That's what you, no matter, that's another tip too. No matter how many people that you see watching, don't worry about that. Just play the game, have fun, and just keep that. Just just keep that, basically. No matter what you play. Just always make sure you're having fun. Appreciate the follow, by the way, though. I'm going to toss it back to you. Because you say you, you're just starting out. Sorry, I'll toss that back to you. Right now, I'm at 30 followers. Aiming for affiliate. Takes a while, dude. But like I say, it's, it's, just keep at it. And I promise you, it'll be worth it. Alright, so I've never been in this office. Because you don't come here as Leon. Copy of emails to Chief Irons. Please, Chief Irons, as thanks for your unwavering support, I have deposited a small sum into your account to use as you see fit. I hope I can count on you to maintain surveillance or while subordinates, especially ones who survive that mansion. Ooh. Give it to me if you want. WB. William Birkin. Okay. Uh, Police Chief Irons, I ran into some trouble with Umbrella Headquarters. The suits want to take care of the fruit of my research away. They want to take it away. But don't worry, this will all blow over soon. You just keep doing what I tell you to and everything will be all right. Police Chief Irons, you're up to the security. You're up to the security around my lab. You are up to the security around my lab. What? Anyway, your muscle is I just shoot any suspicious person on site, no matter if they kill them, or even if they're umbrella employees. I'm so close to completing G, no asshole's gonna get in my way. Please, Chief Irons, get your shit together and do your fucking job. I told you I need more security in the sewers. Let you know how critical of a time this is for me. That's for money. I can pay whatever I, once I can take over, but not before. Why don't you get that? Never forget how expendable you are, you son of a bitch. Ooh. And it's a save room, too. Holy shit. A tip, oh, a tip from my my no recovery run blue and red green. Yep, reds and blues, like Walking Plague said, they give you the they give you the shield buff, but you don't get to heal. You don't get to heal from it. I discovered that late in my playthrough, and I made use of it during my tyrant fight because all I had left was a full heal, one of these, and a red and green. So when I start the fight, you know I will pop this, or I will pop a red and green. And then I would have, I have that one hill to back me up. Fuck. I got two nades. I can put that up for now. I can run. There's nothing around. I'm not going to save because I didn't, I didn't do shit. But yeah. Uh, red and green gives you the shield buff. Well, you did a no recovery run 
Like you did like a no healing run? Not bad, dude. See, shit like that will get you viewers. Because Walking Play thought about streaming as well. Told him on a time. Like, you have the skill set to like do shit like. Because he does like, all right, for example, one thing we had in mind for when he comes over, we had the idea of hanging out and then him doing a knife only run for Cole Veronica. Because that's, that's his favorite RP RPG. That's his favorite Resident Evil. Uh, and I, I thought about him doing that for the stream. Like, you know, just because. Um. Like I figured, why not? Like that's a good little that's a good little thought. But or for his stream as well, I'm like, yo, just do it. <clears throat> and uh, I guess it'll borrow my Elgato and just be both just forgot to be honest. But yeah, <clears throat> did I do the first half? Oh, all right, all right, why, 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 why? There's still shit to find in here. You might, oh, you don't have to, but I appreciate. It. Same to you, same to you. You didn't have to, thanks for the follow. You definitely didn't have to follow, but I do appreciate it. Literally, likewise. <laughs> My experience, which is supportive on a whole. With rare exceptions. Rare run has been great. There you go. Good shit. The hell is that? Some machine gun ammo? I didn't even see that, to be honest. It's a good thing I look at the map all the time. Now we're done. Okay. All right, so I'm running this. Got that. Okay. I'm pretty sure I get it. Oh, shit. Documents. Jesus Christ. Taxidermy log. White-tailed deer. Male, approximately six years old. Place to capture. Auckland Mountains. Length six feet one. 350, 353 pounds. Pleased with how it turned out. But I'm getting tired of working on these puny things. Maybe time to move on to more challenging animals. Siberian tiger, you son of a bitch. Male, approximately four years old. Place of capture. Ka oh my god. Ka Kabrovsky. Kabrovsky. What the fuck? Word. Dude. Lengths, nine foot six inches. 529 pounds. That was a tiger? Holy shit. Then he came when I sliced his yellow belly open and his warm gut spilled out. I still smell. I still smell a wild beast. This is the life. Pig, female, 22 years old. Place to catch it, Raccoon City. Five foot, 310 pounds. This specimen body is soft, sweet, and white all over. Oh, shit. Tim, remind, uh, remind me. Is that his wife? Or his ex wife, or whatever? The blonde chick he gutted up, he he had on his table, or whatever the fuck, in the original, and whatnot. Was that his wife? I think it was his wife or ex-wife or whatever. So glad this game is way harder than the OG. Oh, this game's hard as fuck, mostly because of the damage and shit. That they, like I said, you get if anybody anybody who's not playing hardcore or not too familiar of it by now. Uh, hardcore is fucking rough, dude. Mostly because of how bullet spongy the zombies are. And if you're at full health, you get bit once and you're in danger. Like I said earlier, I was fought, I was fighting Mr. X, I think, or something. Or I forget what I was fighting. I was at full health and I died. Ooh, that's a save. They're trying to tell me something. I'm still not going to save because I took damage from that crawler asshole. Uh, yeah, it's his wife. Some Raccoon City celebrity. Okay. I feel like it's his wife or ex-wife or whatever that was that oh, that's that um but yeah, i'm still not gonna save though Let's see if i can get through this without getting touched so this asshole pops up so then get ready for that one of these oh that i can push that Repair shop letter. From your description regarding electronic lock on the door to police chief's office, it sounds like something needs replacing. You will need some power panel parts to fix the issue. Well, fortunately, fortunately, a repair man, the repair man, 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 from out from one of our stores at the station to repair the bell at the clock tower. We sent a few spare parts for them. Before they left, 
one in the third floor, each storage room. If something goes wrong, you need more than that one. Please don't hesitate to seek him out in the tower. We look forward to serving you again. Hold on for a second. Okay. You still seen? I hope I am. I'm, I'm pretty sure they did keep that. They had to have kept that. <clears throat> uh, we sent a few spare parts with him, and he reported that he left one in the third floor east storage room. If something goes wrong, you need more than one. Please don't hesitate to seek him out in the clock tower. Okay. Yeah, because I'm on the other side of that place that I couldn't get to. That was this. Harky. Give me that. So I need, oh, it's this puzzle again. I need two parts still, gotcha. Who's even in there? What is that? Oh, I know what that is. <clears throat> 